What's up everybody? Uh, Surfing Daddy Pops is here again. Um, gonna do a mystery box. It is uh, Pop King Paul's $50 uh, affordable box. He put a bunch of stuff together. Um, I looked for the post. I think it was a combination of exclusives and possible chases. Nothing crazy high end, um, but big value for us people that like to do mystery boxes and a little bit affordable price. So $50 plus shipping. Um, it might have came out to 60 or 62, I don't recall. But either way, we're gonna go 50 bucks. Uh, I already took the label off, that's all I did. It says, from Fragili, just getting fragile. Um, boxes are solid. Um, I actually use most of his boxes to repack stuff when I'm shipping them out. Um, it does take a little bit of time for him to get them all together. He lives in Texas, and it's always about 10 to 14 days, which is fine. His boxes, any of his boxes, I don't care what he sells, and he's gonna dip into some other ideas um, sell out between 30 seconds and up to five minutes um, pending how many boxes he has up for sale he did some out-of-the-box stuff it took a little longer um, for those out-of-box collectors which there was some fire um, other than that the last few have been really good it's always hard to get them um, we get straight to it though um, the combination of the $50 affordable box is gonna be anywhere from two to four pops I think is what it said I'm gonna I'm gonna guess it's definitely three or four in this one. Um, I just ripped off the sides because the labor is there, so there's no address or anything like that. Um, you'll probably see first as I open it up, and I can see it in the camera, of course, too. But it's cool. Let's see what happens here. Oh, geez. Okay, six. <laughs> so maybe there's some commons. So either way, we'll see what happens here. Um, holy crap, there's gonna be six of them. I'll sneak that out and we'll go one at a time. Actually, it's perfect though. The boxes are all the back. I can't even tell what it is. Number one. Gold Iron Spider. That's awesome. I'm a huge Spider-Man fan. I already have that, actually. Um, actually, my daughter has it upstairs where I have it downstairs to my collection. I can't remember because we're both big Spider-Man fans. Sweet, okay, not a problem there. Eight, nine bucks. I looked a little bit. Old school, Batgirl, nice. I like that classic look. I'm not a huge DC fan, but I do like the classic look. I do have a couple DC things that I'm holding on to, just um, nostalgia-wise. Aquaman, Wonder Woman, old school. Um, uh, which one did I just get? I forgot. Superman. That's what I like. I like the old ones. Other than that, that's another cheapie. Let's see. Oh, Inner Protector. Another Batman. So we're on a DC kick. That one's pretty cool. You don't see those much around. It was a Hot Topic exclusive. So it looks like right now the trend is going to be probably 55 to 60 bucks if I was going to guess. Oh boy, I got a football one, I think. But I know who I can give it to. My neighbor, Jason. Yeah awesome that's cool heck i don't even know if he's even starting for me he's gonna get fired <laughs> or we're gonna have an nfl season who cares okay last two i did not look for oh a damaged one got a damaged one garth wayne's world cool don't really need it oops all right last one not Oh, cool. Old school Riddler. That one I definitely am going to keep. I like the Jim Carrey version, the new ones that came out. Um, that's just the movies that we grew up on. I don't think, again, any of these are worth anything. Maybe 8 to 10 bucks max. So it would be 45 to $60. So um, just a bunch of cool little commons. No really, well, except for the Hot Topic exclusive. It's cool. Um... I'll probably hold on to that one for sure. I'll give that one to a buddy. Probably sell that one. Got a pop protector out of it. This classic Batgirl is really cool. Just a little bit of damage on the box. But I like that old school label. Um, I might even take Mr. Spider-Man out of the box. Now that I have an extra one. And Garth. So. Nothing crazy. No wow factor. Just a cool little deal. Support his... Uh, 
his uh, mystery boxes because again he does a pretty good job um, and they're they're very well known. He has some high end ones like seven fifty, eight hundred, nine hundred bucks, which is way out of our league. Um, sometimes these are good for fillers, but hope you enjoyed it. Nothing too crazy, but uh, hope you guys have a good week. Talk to you soon. Serving Day Pops out.